for it is for an appointed time. And what's really significant about that is you have to understand when you're trying to make your vision your reality, it works counterclockwise. Meaning you see the full picture of what your vision is going to be, but then you have to go all the way back from the very beginning, kind of like an architect who has a vision in his mind what this building is going to look like. He may decide that he's going to design a 20-story building. It's a vision that's in his mind. So the first thing he has to do is sit down, write it out, do a blueprint, get the materials, have the help that he needs, and then to begin to make his vision his reality. So it's counterclockwise, right? And what's very significant is this, write the vision. The significance of that is you have to be able to first yourself to see it in writing. Think about it, right? It's very spiritual. When God was serious about something, guess what he did? He wrote on the tablets the Ten Commandments. So it's very significant when you write something down. Write the vision. Make it plain. So you want to simplify it. It doesn't have to be very difficult. It doesn't have to be very exquisite. Make it plain. But the reason you're making it plain, not for you, because you understand what you want your vision to be. It says make it plain so those who read will run with it. Because truly, when you have a vision, you cannot carry it alone. You have to have assistance. You have to have a team, a network of people to help your dream, your vision come to pass. So you have to make it plain so those who read it can run with it. And actually, God gave me a revelation about that that particular statement in that scripture just last week. So I was thinking, oh my God, I have all these things that I need to do. I need help. Now, I, 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 and I meant to bring it, I forgot to bring it. When all the way back to 10 years ago, I said, this is what I want to do. And I've written it down. I, I have it everywhere. I have, a, I have a mission statement for my company, which is speaking about mediocrity. And the mission is to eradicate any resemblance of mediocrity. I have a mission statement for my life. So, and I have it all written down. 